What's up guys, it's Devin, or that child gamer. Welcome to a new game called Presentable Liberty. This game I found on Game Jolt. Um, I'm trying out different uh, things. I'm trying out different uh, websites and stuff for different free games and stuff like that. This game is free on Game Jolt. The link will be in the description if you guys can check this game out by yourself. Um, and from what I'm aware of, this game isn't the most happiest. Um, because... I watched the trailer and I see I've seen some pictures and it just excuse me it just looks horrible like it just like it looks like something is gonna go horribly wrong but I don't know this until I get into it so we're gonna start from the beginning day one interesting big text oh and I do apologize for the frame rate being horrible um, there's no settings in this game there's not a single thing of setting <laughs> so I'm playing this at a like a nice 30 frames <laughs> um, so enjoy that while you can guys uh, what are we supposed to be doing here we're just in a room can I get out of here can I not get out okay press the left mouse button to open the letter under the door oh okay my dear friend, I hope this letter finds you well. How is prison life going? Okay, so I'm in prison. How is prison life going for you? I know it must be hard, especially in times like these. As for me, I will soon start another one of my journeys into the unknown. Into the unknown. Wish me luck, Salvador the Traveler. Salvador. That's a nice name. I like that name. Friend. I hope you aren't feeling too lonely in that dark cell. Just in case, they, I, I have put a little bug friend for you in the envelope alongside this letter. I see the bug! I see the bug! Hi, little buggy! Hi, buggy! Hi, bug! Buggy! Bug! Oh. Can't interact with the bug. I wish that was a thing in this game, is interacting with the bug. Okay, what do I do? Just sit here and wait for letters? Because the, uh, the picture said that you receive letters from multiple people. So I guess you're just supposed to pick letters up this entire time? Good day. We are happy to inform you that you have been selected by me, Dr. Money, to join an exclusive program for inmates all over the country. We have noticed that due to the recent outbreak of, terrible, of a terrible virus, the population of our beautiful nation has started dwindling. This is unfortunate, but there is still hope. You. You hear that, guys? You. You are their hope. You are their his hope. Recent studies show that 98% of our great nation's population is already infected with the virus. Incidentally, many of the remaining 2% are prison inmates like you. We hope that you continue to be vigilant and remain healthy. In order to fight depression and suicidal thoughts in the... This is already horrible. In the dire situation you have found yourself in, you will be assigned your own personal happy buddy. Enjoy. Trademark. I like that. Hello, hello, hello! I am your personal, own personal happy buddy! I have a present for you! Five confetti poppers! Have fun! Press the right mouse button to use items. Oh, it's so great! I like confetti! I like confetti. It's very slow. Hello, my buddy friend buddy! Did you enjoy the confetti? If so, I have another present for you! Interesting. It's a Dr. Money Portable Entertainment Machine, game included! Have lots of fun! Use the mouse wheel to switch between items. Mouse wheel, okay. So there is my there there's my Game Boy, can I use it now? Oh, I'm sorry, it's the, uh, the Dr. Money's Portable Entertainment product. Uh, I guess we're going Serpent. Okay, oh, 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 what the... This... Whoa, 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 I don't like the controls to this. I don't like the controls to this. I don't like the controls to this. This is horrible. Dr. Money, your game is so bad. You can't make games. Oh my jeez. Okay, this is actually a really horrible game, and I don't like it. What? Oh my jeez. This is actually really annoying. Why? This isn't even part of the game. Okay, so I'm gonna... Oh, I don't want that. Okay. How do I get out of this? Uh... Oh, okay, I just right click to stop using it. Okay. My dear friend, they have started. I have started my journey in the Far East with no clear goal in mind. Is this hell again? On the road. 
I, I th that looks like a J. I met a nice woman who gave me direction to the nearest lake. You know how much I like swimming. Friend, this lake is beautiful. It is so peaceful and quiet here. Have you ever been so alone that you cannot convince yourself to the fact that other people exist anymore? That sounds very depressing. <laughs> Friend, I have a present for you. It's a painting that always reminds me of the spirit of travel. I hope it will li live it up your cell a little bit. Is there, it there is! I got a painting! Guys, I love it! It's, it's beautiful, Sal! I think this is my happy buddy. Hey, buddy, how you doing? If you're feeling down, maybe a song will help. La 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 la, happy la la, glad to la 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 la, be alive la la. Oh. Whoa. That just changed mood real fast. Okay. I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> That's. I'm going to move my chair over so I'm a little more in line with the camera because this is still something I'm getting used to. <laughs> that was fun, wasn't it? I hope you keep a song in your heart always. For you, you are smart and kind and important. Great. Oh, is this this is this literally the game? Is just me standing here and just looking at letters, like hearing the story going on outside. Hey, it's Mr. Money. I mean, Dr. Money. Good day, Mr. Smiley. We have noticed that. Am I Mr. Smiley? Okay. I guess that's my name. <laughs> We have noticed that you have not met your happiness quota yet. Remember, you only get to see your daughters again if you manage to lower the suicide suicide rates in prison. Is this for me? Is this my happy buddy? Well then. Dear... Devin, <laughs> we may have accidentally sent you a letter addressed to a certain Mr. Smiley. We want you to know that this mistake has been rectified and that your happy buddy really does like you and is your best friend purely because you are so friendly. I suddenly don't believe a word you're saying anymore. Dr. Money, you're a horrible person. Ooh, it's getting darker. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm feeling so great! You are my bestest, friendliest, happy friend in the whole wide world! I can't even see the letters anymore. Friend, if my calculations are correct, then this letter will arrive at your cell right around bedtime. I hope those prison beds are comfortable. Good night, friend, Salvador. I can't even see my bed. Okay, I guess I press space. Day two. Day one went by so quick and everything has already started becoming very depressing. That's... This was a bad idea. <laughs> this is actually, this game, like, literally, I don't know if I'm supposed to be sad, I don't know if I'm supposed to be, like, mortified, but there's fucked up shit going on right now. <laughs> like, horrible fucked up shit. Rise and shine, sleepyhead! I hope you had a good night's sleep! I sure did! Hooray! To celebrate the occasion of you getting up, I've sent you a second game for your Portal Entertainment product! I get to play another game. What is it this time? Fear of Fire. Oh. Oh. See, I can actually control this game just a little bit better. I like that. This game is a little bit easier to control. This game... I, I enjoy this game. I like this game a lot. This is my favorite game. This is the game that I want to play for the rest of my life. In prison. Okay, well, let's look at the letter while we're wasting time playing video games. <laughs> which is what we're doing right now. <laughs> Friend, I have decided to head north, which is, as you know, my favorite cardinal direction to head. On the way, I passed by a very interesting river. A sign next to it said that the water changes the direction it is flowing in around this time of year. Fascinating, wouldn't you say, friend? I must stay here and witness the change occurring. My curiosity is just too tremendous to resist the temptation. As much as I enjoy vast landscapes and new locations to explore, sometimes in life one must appreciate the little things. <laughs> I said another present for you! It's a poster to remind you to always keep a smile on your face! Let me have another picture, don't we? That looks like the Kool-Aid Man. That actually kind of looks like the Kool-Aid Man. That uh, is that Kool-Aid? Please tell me that's Kool-Aid, not what I think it is. Uh, 
<laughs> I don't like this game anymore. I lied. Ooh, it's a new person. Uh, it's pink. Should I do a girl voice? It's pink. I don't know. Whatever. Good day. I don't think you know me, but from what I've heard, it seems that you and I are the last people in this town who are still not infected with the virus. I am the owner of a pastry shop not far from where your cell is, but as I don't want to get infected, I, but I don't want... I, what? This isn't... I can't even speak this. Like, the, the, the font is so, like, really descriptive. I cannot sell my pastries to anyone anymore except you. I would really appreciate it if you would come visit me sometime. And maybe I ha maybe have a cup of tea. My British accent is not on on my it's not on par today. By the way, my name is Charlotte. Charlotte. So it is a girl. Nice to meet you. Yeah. My life is horrible in this in this game. Am I literally? Why, if she's not infected, why is she allowed to be free making pastries in her shop? And I'm stuck here in a prison cell. Whatever, let's play some let's play some more fear of fire while we wait. Because at least we're doing something. <laughs> Ooh, another letter. A funny thing is you went to clip past that level too and I just exited it. And I think I'm still on that level. Yeah, I am. Okay. My dearest companion, the river's change in direction was quite interesting to see. This is exactly what I love about my travels. You always get to see new and amazing things. Salvador. Let's play Fear of Fire again. I'm not playing Serpent. Serpent's just way too hard, in my opinion. To be completely honest, I don't like Serpent. Is this literally all the game is? Is just fire everywhere and you have to avoid it? This is actually a very simple and easy game. We're on level 7, and there's a lot of fire already. There was like 4 at level 1, and now there's like 20 million. Does it get harder? I should not have said that, because now there's blue fire everywhere. I That was the perfectest timing I've ever had in a video. Letter! I messed up, frick. I'm very sorry if I came... Oh, I'm very sorry if I came off as too eager in my last letter to you. Fact is, I haven't really had much contact with people anymore lately. Please forgive me and I've, if, I, if I've made you feel uncomfortable. No, not at all. In fact, you're probably one of the less, you know, less crazy people that I've been getting messages from. I mean, everybody else, like, literally talks like they're in a freaking fantasy. I mean, first of all, happy... And Dr. Money, I can't even trust. Right off the bat. And Salvador, is he actually my friend? Or is he just this one, this random guy that I have no clue who he is? Apparently he likes rivers, though. Oh, I used the wrong item. Well, you know what? Celebration for... Celebration for having somebody talk to us again, I guess. Yeah. Fear of Fire, let's do it. Let's play some more Fear of Fire. Just stay right here. Letter! Letter, 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 letter. Oh, it's Happy Buddy. Ah. Hello, hello, hello! I hope you're enjoying your two games. They were expensive, you know. <laughs> well, why'd you buy them? Why'd you buy me the most expensive games ever? That was not my decision, that was yours. <laughs> no wonder you're not happy. But they call you Mr. Smiley and you're yet you're freaking spending your wallet for somebody you don't even know. <laughs> oh, this this is getting suddenly very 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 hard. Oh my Jesus Lord. Letter, 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 letter. Okay, let me just finish this level and then letter. Yeah, okay, we're good. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm I'm dandy. I got I I have my uh I have my fear of fire I'm playing. I'm I'm very happy. I'm happy with this game. I'm very happy. This game is actually a really good game. I like this game. In fact, I wish I had Is this like a is this like actually its own game or did somebody actually who made this game have the idea? I don't even know. Is this like supposed to resemble another game cuz it doesn't look familiar. Letter! 
from Happy Buddy again. No, don't put that. I know it must be hard all alone in her present cell, but you must remain happy! Please. That's very depressing. Oh, there's small little tiny ones now. That's not okay. Fire! I mean, a uh, letter. Oh my god. It has come to our attention that your happy buddy has shown signs of not behaving in an excited and happy manner. If you wish to have your happy buddy replaced, please just send us a letter and we will get rid of him. I don't know how you suppose that I do that. As much as I want to because he's being creepy to me. Um, I can't do that. I have no paper. You didn't leave me any paper. You didn't leave me any pen or pencil or anything. In fact, I'm stuck in this jail cell where I can barely even fit my hand outside the freaking door. So how do you suppose I send you a letter? Hello! <laughs> Hello! I heard that some people are reporting their happy buddies to Dr. Mummy! <laughs> uh, you wouldn't believe it, Mr. Smiley. Let's play some more Fear of Fire. Okay, no we're not. <laughs> you know what happens to them, right? Do you? Well, you wouldn't want to do that to me, would you? <laughs> what, do they terminate them or something? Do they, like, do they chop their limbs off and feed them to the dogs? The very infected virus D dogs? Oh, please survive this. Please survive this. No! I was at one second! You've gotta be joking. This is the most hardest game... Okay. This is the most hardest game I've ever played. <laughs> I'm sorry I haven't gotten to another game yet. I just don't have the money for it at the moment. Then why did you buy me expensive games? Nobody told you that you had to buy me expensive games. I am very happy, and I'm very suited with whatever somebody gives me. In fact, since I don't expect anything, I don't really... I don't force you to make it good anyway. I'm so sorry. Why? Why are you sorry? Because you can't decide to choose what's best for business? I still have my buggy friend. My buggy friend's there. Hi, buggy. I'm so, so very sorry. Why? You're you're doing this to yourself. Mr. Smiley, you're so... I don't know what I'm supposed to do with my life. This game is like making me question everything. This game is not what it seemed. Like, I knew this there was something fishy going into it, but I did not know that it was going to turn into a depression story, because that's pretty freaking hard. I mean, look at this! There's freaking... I'm pretty sure that's blood on a Kool-Aid man! How was that not weird and awkward? Friend, is your bug friend keeping you company? Yes, in fact, I just talked to him. <laughs> Have you given him a name? I should... I should name him. You should. Uh, wow, I didn't even read that, and that was like perfect timing. <laughs> Do, you <re> <laughs> Do you remember how we used to sit by the fireside carving chess pieces out of wood without a care in the world? That was a long time ago. I don't remember this because I just started this game. My wood carving skills have gotten significantly worse, but I still try to make you something to make you feel less lonely. It's the leg of a table I'm making for you. I know that it might not be the most extravagant project, but I hope you like it anyways. Okay. Oh! Hey! There's a table leg! How big is this table? That looks like a giant leg! How big is the table going to be? That's interesting. It looks like it's getting dark out too, so there might be uh, like another good night letter. Oh, I'm going to get comfy because that was... Uh, who is it? Charlotte? Charlotte! It's a nice evening, isn't it? I hope you can have a nice sleep. That's my good night letter right there. That was the perfect timing. I've got a lot of perfect timing in this video, haven't I? Pretty sure it's going to make me go to bed now. There we go. Right at, right at uh, that, that time, when it hits the 12, it turns to night time. So, another letter from Happy Buddy. Morning, morning, morning! I have some very, very good news for you. Okay, what's the news? I got you a new game <laughs> with the last of my money. This is the game of perfect timing. This one's a real blast. Have fun. Okay, let us play that game then, shall we? 
Uh, piteous moonlight. That sounds very depressing. Oh, so it's like Flappy Bird, except easier. Bull crap, I hit that. Okay, after this level, I'm gonna see that letter. There we go. Oh, don't right click. Don't worry about me spending all my money, I'm okay. No, you're not. I can promise you right now, the way you've been acting with me lately, you're not okay. Just stay happy for me, for all, for the love of all that is holy, stay happy, they're watching. Who's watching? Is it Dr. Money? Because I've kind of made that clue back a while ago when I got that letter that was addressed to you. I'm going to drink some Gatorade. Not sponsored. The world has become such a quiet place. Sure has. Because I, I, I'm losing my patience to get more letters. This is a very slow, slow game. In fact, I don't know if you call it a game. Let's play some more Fear of Fire. I want to get to level 20. Okay, let's not play Fear of Fire because we got another letter. So many people are dying. I watched them choke to death from my pastry shop's window. Whoa. Dr. Money has started selling some kind of antidote. But I don't trust him. Neither do I. After that letter that I got from him a while ago, I do not trust Dr. Money. In fact, I don't even trust Mr. Smiley. Because he lied to me. He lied to me real good. Frick. This game is getting, like, abnormally hard. That's kind of annoying. Come on. Come on. Three, two, one. Yeah! Okay. <laughs> I will not leave my shop. As much as the loneliest pains me, I need to remain here. Okay. Well, why don't you come and visit me? I mean, I can't go anywhere. You don't have to be painful from loneliness if you just come to me. I surely enough can't go anywhere, and I want to know who the hell I'm talking to. I don't even know Salvador. Apparently he's my lifelong friend. I don't even know who the hell that is. How are you doing? They have been busy carving the second leg. I've been busy. Oh my god, I hate the eyes. Leg here for your table. May you eventually put a tabletop on it. I am starting to feel a little homesick. Perhaps it's time to end my journey. I've played enough games to realize to know what that can mean. So please tell me that that's not what you actually mean by ending your journey. Because I will... I'm gonna scream. Hey, my second leg's done! That was a nice mood change. Where's my bug? My buggy bug. Where's my bug at? Buggy! Buggy! That's what I'm gonna name him, Buggy. That's that's gonna be the name. And we got another letter. <laughs> there have been incidents of people getting upset about how hard the games are for Dr. Money's portable entertainment product. There are... Yeah, they're not that easy, Mr. Smiley. Please do remember, it's not about those games, it's about happiness! I just got another letter, but whatever. Frick! Oh my god. Okay, whatever. I found this poster in my attic. I, oh, wait. I found this poster in my attic. I thought that it might cheer you up. Then again, it's not very cheerful. Maybe you want it anyway, though. I swear to god, if it's another bloody poster... It's not bloody, but it's also not very... It's very uneasy, I'll say. It kind of looks like the wall. kind of blends in very well. Dear Devin, Dr. Money is taking time off his busy schedule to personally tell you that everything is fine. I, once again, don't believe a word you are saying. <laughs> Just saying. Okay, we have another video. I mean, we have another, <laughs> we have another uh, letter. Did you get the doctor's message? I am increasingly concerned by the way he's ignoring the people's obvious suffering. The antidote he's talking about is only being sold at a ludicrous price. He does not mean well. We're going to play some more Fear of Fire. And my reasoning, as always, is because I can. Another letter. It's great. 
No. Friend! That third leg of your table is finished! Ha <laughs> ha! A hoorah! Is that even an R? I have also started my long journey back home. Okay, so he actually meant that he's ending his journey. That's great. I'm so glad that didn't mean other things. I would say... I will probably arrive around tomorrow morning. Looking forward to seeing some familiar faces. Sal. The doctor has lowered the price of the antidote, however, it seems to cause various vital organs to fail. People are now not only dying from the virus, but also from the cure. I am terrified. Yeah. Why are you telling me this? <laughs> Why are you telling me what's going on outside? Why can't you just come here? If you know where you're sending these letters, come find me and come let me out. Obviously, I'm not actually supposed to be here. I didn't do anything wrong. I'm just here because somebody wants to protect me. But I'm perfectly fine just standing on the, uh, standing on the day. Hell yeah. Did it. Most of my cakes have gone bad. I just hope all this is over soon. I'm not sure how long I can live all alone. I wish I can come visit you. Then do so. You obviously have enough time. You have enough time to send all these letters. But you don't have enough time to make your way all the way down here to actually greet me formally and, and to maybe let me out, maybe bring some some metal bar cutters, cut these bars and let me out of here. <laughs> what is this thing? Are those wires? They look like wires. What do they go to? Yeah, you know, like a light switch that. There's no lights in here. I don't know. Let's play some more Piteous Moonlight. I want to get this. Okay, let's not play Piteous Moon. Again, with the whole, you know, letters while I'm trying to play games. I hope you were getting these letters. I'm guessing you can't just, you just can't respond. Thank you for realizing that. Do letters still get delivered in times like these? I hope so. Are you even still alive? Yes. Yes, I am still alive. Friend, I this gives, this one gave me some problems, but your fourth leg, table leg, is all done now. Last part will be there very shortly. Yeah! Awesome, we can get the top soon. Buggy, I just saw you. Why does Buggy always like to hide? I want to celebrate. I'm going to celebrate. Where's, where, where? Yeah! Streamers! Love this game. This is a great game. These streamers are falling very, 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 very slowly. My goal before the end of this video is to get to, is to, get to level 20. Are you okay? Apparently more and more inmates are killing themselves. Please don't do that. For your sake and mine. That wasn't on my to-do list. So you don't have to worry about that. Well, oh, I was so close. My dear friend, my good night present to you will be the tabletop. Now you'll finally have room, uh, something to put your stuff on in the cell. I hope you actually have stuff to put it on it. I don't. I like the table. I really, really like the table, but I have nothing to put on it. Maybe I crumpled up this picture and that picture, but that's about it. And it's already almost bedtime, so that's good. We can go to bed and now. Day four. How many days is this anyway? Let me put this back on. Just make sure I didn't mute myself this entire time. That would suck. Friend, my journey has come to an end. As you know, I do not have a family to come home to, but that's not what matters to me. I am just looking forward to the smell of my hometown. Great. You're not going to like the smell of vital organs failing and stuff like that. I can tell you that. Fear fire. Let's do it again. Why would they spit fire last second? That's so dumb. Where is everyone? Dead. Like I told you. <laughs> well, like I told you in my head. This is the hardest game I've ever played. Wow. Morning! I, I don't even know why I clapped. More. I did it again. Morning! I sold my house and my food and one of my lungs, but don't worry. <laughs> um, why? I spent the money in another game for you! Yay, have fun, be happy! Dude, you're killing yourself because you want me to be happy. Your life as it is, is depressing. 
Why would you do this? What game is it? Triangle Wars. Um, oh! Oh! <laughs> I can cheat the system, that's great! I just broke the game. I broke the game! <laughs> These streets used to be so lively, now they're just silent. Did I actually break that game? It like fell through the game, okay. I have this old gramophone in, gra gramophone in my basement. Perhaps it is time to break the silence? Do it. Play it. Play it away. I want to hear your beautiful music. Then again, I'm in a prison cell. I pr probably wouldn't be able to hear it whatsoever. Okay, we're not playing that again. Do you know what's going on out here? The virus? The organs? The blood? Yes, I do. I've been getting letters all freaking for the past four days yet about them. I really didn't want those letters, but I got them. Come on, come on. Yeah. Yeah! Last level. Last level, guys. Guys, this is the last level. I want to finish this. It's so hard. I can't. Mistakes were made. I, Dr. Money, want to personally apologize for any inconveniences that may have arisen from the virus of our creation. Please accept this framed picture of Money as consolation. Money survives all hardship. Great. That's actually a lot better than this and that. So, I mean, great. Thanks, Dr. Money. I appreciate it. People are dying. Thanks for reminding me. Their organs are failing because of an antidote for the virus. Everyone is infected. I wonder if I am too. Sal, don't talk like that, because it's probably true. <laughs> Come on, I want to get... I really want to get this. Five. Frick. It's like, is there a way to beat that level at all? There seems to be a huge market for working organs now. Dr. Money has a big supply, and everyone is rushing to the stores and spending all their money. But those organs are not what they seem. Two. One. No! You shot fire at me right there! I would have had that! Anyone who uses the doctor's organs die in a couple of hours later. Where do they come from? What are they? Does it even matter anymore? Are you infected too, friend? I hope not. Three. No! I want this level so badly. I want to say that I can complete this game. Like a game inside of a game. No! I was there again! This game is so hard. How much of the outside Oh, how much of the outside world can you hear in your cell? How high are you even up? I guess I can't know. Just listen closely. I can hear that! I can hear that! I'm gonna play some game while that's going on. <laughs> And it stopped, so that's that's the thing. Could you hear from up there? I turned it up extra loud for you. There's no better times than these for a little music, and yet I feel so lonely. So why don't you come visit? I have been saying that right along, and you have not been listening to me. So that's not my fault. Of course I could play the music again, but is it worth it? It'll never be the same magical moment again. That one moment in between all of the dreary ones. Oh, Dodd. Don't, don't say that you're going to become suicidal, because that's not what I'd like. That's not okay. Uh, let, me, let me finish this level. Three, two, one. 
No, my gosh! This can't go on forever. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't say that. that don't, don't say that, because that makes me think that you're going to do something. And I don't want that. Nobody wants that. I can't even get far anymore. I don't even know how many people are dead. I'm afraid to look. I can only see what's outside my window, and I see nothing but blood. I think I'm alone. Everyone is dead. Don't say things like that. You're scaring me, Charlotte. The city's lights are going out. But that don't mean anything. This town has no electricity anymore. Only the lights the only lights I see are coming from the prison. One more day. One more day until what? One more day until what? Nobody told me about anything about what's happening in a day. You're the first person. Six, five, four, three. Oh my god. Tomorrow evening. What's happening tomorrow evening? Until then, you must come here. I can't! I'm locked in a prison! You figured out that I can't send messages back to you. What makes you think that I can come there? I'm getting... I'm actually starting to get angry. Like, I'm getting paranoid of what's going on in the outside right now. I will wait here. If you can't make it, well, I fear this world has no place for me. Don't say that, please. Don't do that. That's the last thing that anybody wants. I am awaiting your arrival. Until then, here's a cake I made for you. I hope you like it. Cake! She made me a cake. Yeah, think about it. Th now that I think about it, I haven't eaten at all. <laughs> that noise, that eating noise. I'm gonna save the cherry for the buggy. Did you hear that wonderful music? I tried to hear it ahead in its direction, but it was over too quickly. I'm so tired. I will just go to sleep in some empty apartment around here. God knows there's enough of those now. I need to see you again, friend. You are probably still in that cell, all alone. Tomorrow I will come visit you, but first let us rest, friend. Okay, so it's becoming... Is it becoming nighttime at all, or...? No, it's not. Not yet. Buddy, are you playing your games? Are you happy? I can't beat that stupid freaking level. What do you think? I'm happy, but tired. Sleep, buddy, sleep. Let's play some Piteous Moonlight again. Or not. Tomorrow, it will all end. What is happening tomorrow? Oh boy. I have no idea what's going on. I really don't. Day five. Good. Goody, goody morning. All good, all fine. I don't care. This is taking a turn, guys. I am not your friend. I was never your friend. Dr. Money was blackmailing me. He kidnapped my daughters. He told me they were safe. He told me they would be okay as long as I kept you happy. But he lied. My daughters are dead. They died from the virus two days ago. I never even got to say goodbye. But to you I will. You cannot lose hope, as now I have. Oh, I didn't even get to read the next part. Shit. I don't have the money for such expensives, but there's a huge market for organs now. I have already sold one of my, one of my lungs yesterday, and now I'll finish what I have started. What did you start? 
I signed for them to take all my organs. Money up front. <clears throat> I will not survive the procedure, of course. But that's not important. You are the only ones left who are still healthy. Please don't lose hope. This game has taken a turn dramatically. I hope you enjoy the game. Okay, so he bought us a game. I doubt it because it isn't fun. Like, seriously, not at all. I hope you keep going anyway. Always keep going. Don't give up like me. You never know how much more time you have. Okay, well, let's play our game. Let's see what game we have. Crank Master. What do, I, what do I do? What do I even do? Oh, okay. I just I just crank. That's that's what I do. It's all the same thing, except just longer time period. That is, that, you're not lying. That is a very not fun game. Goodbye. Goodbye to you too, friend. It has come to our attention that your happy buddy has stopped talking to you. We would like to remind you that you are loved and that you must remain happy. Well, my friend, Dr. Money, I'm not happy. You have uh, killed somebody who I don't even know's daughters. For all I know, you're killing people with freaking antidotes. Which isn't a big antidote at all. And you're taking people's organs. So yeah, I don't forgive you. And I'm not happy. I'm not. Let's try and beat that Fear of Fire game. Because that was a fun game. Yes! I did it! I actually did it! Yes! Oh! Congratulations for completing this game. A valuable, a valuable badge has been placed in your vicinity. So now what? Yeah! I get a badge! So I can't even play that game anymore. That's awesome! I got a badge for completing the game. I'm so happy for myself. I'm now happy. Kind of. I don't. I don't know. I really don't. This is not okay. <laughs> the game is great and all, but the what's been going on outside of the prison cell is not okay. It's really not. You are worth every penny. That's great. If I'm worth th something to you, why are you locking me up? This town is dead. There's no life left in it. I am walking through the streets all alone. I am on my way. Come. Come save me. I need your help. Let's play Triangle Wars. Let's, let's hack Triangle Wars again. Got another letter. Awesome. Let's just finish this level real quick and we'll, we'll get into it. Come on. And I... Glitch through again. Awesome. I think I am close to your prison. I am really looking forward to seeing you again. You being in that cell all this time, you must still be alive, right? Yeah, I am. I'm, I don't know how. I mean, I literally haven't been fed anything other than Charlotte's cake, which I've already eaten, except for the cherry, which I'm saving for Buggy. Um. Yeah. I still want to know what those wires are for. Are those even wires? They gotta be. Like it's red and blue. I mean, if it's not wires, you've got the, you've got the positive side. You've got the negative side. <laughs> Physics. I might be writing to a dead man. I thought this kind. This is kind of scary. The I will not give up though. I was a little virus won't kill you now, will it? You wouldn't believe. Ah, darn it. Oh, I still have any letters, so let's play another let's let's play Glitchy Wars. Or not. Listen. We have noticed that you're being con contacted by someone with a measurably free spirit. 
We would like you to ignore all of his letters from now on. You mean Sal? You mean Salvador? What's wrong with Sal? Oh, you're being, you are being taken care of. You are being protected from the virus and the horrors of the outside world. Do not forget, you are a prisoner. Yeah, I am. I'm your prisoner. I think I can see your prison from here. Maybe one or two hours now. I can't wait. All And once I'm there, I will release you from your prison. Thank you! You're the first person who's listened to what I wanted to do! This friend of yours, Salvador, he cannot be here. I do not appreciate the way he talks. I do not appreciate the way he's talking about freedom for you. Yeah, because you're 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 somebody who don't want me to leave. You're a kidnapper. You kidnap daughters, you kidnap organs, you kidnap buddy, you kidnap me. What are you gonna do? Kidnap him next? This is no joke. Seize all contact with the Salvador. Friend, I have arrived! Where is your cell? Where are those letters being sent to? I cannot seem to even enter the building. All the doors are locked. I broke in, but the elevator won't come and there's no stairs. It seems that I have no way of getting however high up you are. There must be a way. It is getting late, friend. Maybe I don't have to get up there. Maybe maybe you could come down here. And we're back to square one again. I can't leave the freaking prison cell! You know, this building you are in was never supposed to be a prison. There are no cells on the bottom floor, and looking at the plans, there were no cells here anywhere. Dr. Money must have repurposed the building for locking you up. Why would he do that? It seems so... Ab 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 that word. You don't think that... But no matter. No, and what matters is that the lock on your cell door is powered by electricity, which means that... If I manage to destroy the prison's generator, you'll be free to leave, friend. That those wires right there, were those where elevator buttons used to be? Is this an elevator? It can't be though, because look it. Are you coming? Oh, are you coming? Please tell me that you'll come. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be meeting her right about now, huh? I'm so lonely. I'm sorry, friend. No. No, Charlotte. Don't say that. Don't do it. I swear to God. Um. And the sad part is, I saw that coming, too. I'm sorry. I'm happy. I'm perfect. I'm just... Dandy. And it's becoming nighttime, but something tells me I'm not sleeping. I have found the generator. Friend, I will only need to destroy this and you will be free. Come find me at the entrance, friend. I am looking forward to shaking your hand once more. Please, I would love to see you. He did it! Did he do it? Am I free? How do I get out? How do I get out? I want to get out! Oh. Your friend tried to destroy the generator. That didn't really work out for uh, uh, too well for him, did it? He got electrocuted. Fuck! Your friend is dead. Fuck! They all are. I'm alone. I'm actually alone now. Now your cell door may be open. But what do you think leaving will be, will accomplish? This town is dead and you and I are the last ones here. The backup generator only has energy for those red lights. So the door is unlocked now. Just stay in your cell. I will send someone to fix the generator for you. 
You'll be able to keep playing your games on your portable entertainment product without a care in the world. I'll even tell you why you're here. You will never know you will never know that if you leave you will be allowed to do whatever you wish to on one condition. Do not open that door. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm leaving. I'm done. I'm I'm officially out of my cell. Oh, I want this cherry by the way. I, I know Bugsy is not Buggy is not going to eat it. So, yeah, just ate the cherry. That's a fucking elevator. It's obvious cuz all these doors are fucking normal. And that's the elevator door. Oh my god, and here's Look at. I wasn't fucking wrong. Here's the switch. I've been locked in an elevator this entire time. Press pit, yep. And now I'm going down. So this is an actual working elevator. Also, where is this red light coming from? How is this entire cell being lit up by that one little tiny light that keeps flickering out there because the floors are changing? And how high is this building? I was up high if, if that was the case. Oh, that's weird. I don't like that. Okay. Awesome. So now we're on the bottom floor. Now I get to go see what the hell looks like on the outside. That's great. What is that? Charlotte's delicious pa Oh my god, this is Charlotte's place and I see blood. Oh no! Closed, I thought so. There's another cake here too. There's another cake here that I can't eat. Oh no, and it's another Charlotte letter. What's back here? I can't go back here, but I have a feeling that that's where she is and she hit herself. Is that the end? To my only friend. When you're reading this, I will already be dead. My shop will probably look quite messy. I have decided that I'll go back to the room to the back room to die, so you don't have to look at my corpse. I'm sorry, I, I couldn't be more patient in waiting for you. But that doesn't matter now. What matters now is that you're here. Against all odds, you managed to escape the prison. I'm aware that this may seem like a bad ending to the story, but you're here. You're here and I have baked another cake for you. I'm not sure how fresh it will be when you find this, as for all I know you never will. But I hope you enjoy it anyway. I wish you the best of luck. Charlotte. I honestly have no words. I did not expect that kind of thing going into into this game the next morning. Now back at the prison. What's going on here?
Ah, it's my little bug friend. Buggy. He escaped. He he turned into me. The end. Yep. Saw that coming. Great. I have no words. I really, I, I don't have a lot of words for this game. Other than it has a very sad story. Wow. Um. Yeah, so the link will be in, des in the description for this game for you guys to go check it out. Um, but without further ado, I think I'm going to leave it here. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching the uh, video. If you liked it, smash that like button. And subscribe if you're new. I'd love to tune to the channel. Guys, I have a Discord. Come check me out. It's out of YouTube. It's going to be a fun time for all. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did making it. And I hope to see you guys in my next one. Goodbye.